Good morning. It is 5.14 a.m. on Monday, November 26th, 2018. I'm Christiana Ellis, and I just got up. This is five more minutes. So, uh, yesterday, <laughs> yesterday I woke up around 6.30 after having gone to bed at about 12.30 and was thinking to myself, <clears throat> I'm a little tired. That's maybe not quite enough sleep, but... That's perhaps the closest I've gotten to a uh, normal sleep routine uh, since I've been back. Maybe I'm finally readjusted to the time. And uh, then after recording the video, I was thinking, you know what? I could actually could maybe do for with another one or two hours of sleep. But I didn't set an alarm and woke up at 2.30. <laughs> so... Uh, that told me a couple things. One, I was not altogether readjusted yet, but also that my body clearly needed a lot more sleep than it had had. So, uh, although yesterday was another day spent kind of disoriented and feeling a little out of it, um, nonetheless, I was proactive. Uh, I didn't, you know, I didn't have any caffeine at all uh, afternoon and uh, where usually I, you know, that's fine and I don't have a problem, but I didn't have any afternoon and, or I guess I say afternoon. I think I had a little bit when I just got up, so like 2.30 and then, um, uh, but then also didn't have any in the evening is my point really. And then I also took an Advil PM uh, at around like, like seven because I wasn't planning to go to bed at 7, but because I wanted to make sure that by the time, like, morning came, I wouldn't still be groggy from it. And figured also if I was feeling drowsy from the Advil PM, uh, that might encourage me to go to bed earlier. I ended up going to bed at about 9.30 and then waking up at 4.30. So, closer? <laughs> I'm feeling okay right now. I suspect that during the day I will be uh, feeling uh, tired still. I don't think my body is quite all the way where it needs to be yet, but maybe closer. So we'll see. We'll see. But in any event, I am back to work this week. Uh, at least this week I'm working uh, here at the same uh, place that I was working before my trip to Korea. I'm you know, back on site there for a week. Uh, but I'll also be supporting my other project. So it'll be a busy week for me uh, because I'm trying to get things done in advance of going to visit Colorado uh, for family uh, for the first week of December. So that's kind of, you know, got the, the plans in action. Also, I have rescheduled my Extra Life D&D &D game. And so I'm going to be uh, ramping up the... Uh, news and promotion for that again soon but the the basics of it are the same in the sense that what I plan to do is exactly the same except that I'm going to do it on December 15th and 16th instead of uh, November 3rd and 4th so what that means is that if you want to help support uh, raising money for children's hospitals and me playing Dungeons and Dragons with my friends 24 hours over two days, uh, then uh, you can go to the link which will be in the podcast notes uh, below here uh, or, you know, the, the video notes, the doobly-doo as some might say, um, or there will also be a link at my website and I'll be talking a lot about it uh, in the couple of weeks that we have uh, until that comes. And so uh, all contributions go to uh, a great charity and I will, uh, I have, you know, laid out some fun rewards uh, that you can choose from if you are so inclined. So I'll definitely be talking more about that uh, in the next couple of weeks. But in the meantime, I'm kind of just going to see if I can settle back into a work routine. We'll see how that goes. Um, definitely I'm up earlier than I normally would be even with this routine. So I'm a little bit, you know, there's a little bit of that feeling of like, I'm awake. So I don't think I could really go back to sleep. And at this point I shouldn't because it's close enough to when I sh I'm supposed to get up. But 
the the balance of getting all ready and heading in and it's just yeah everything's still a little bit twilight zoney but uh at the very least uh i i think you know i'm not going to have any trouble driving and so uh that's where things are at for me right now so i'll go ahead and leave it there for right now and i'll talk to you all tomorrow for five more minutes